Are you asking me out? Did you say yes? We reached out and touched each other. Next on Sweet Valley Hot. Hey, hot sauce. The guy put hot sauce in my shake. Did I mention I put it in the water too? Well, come in with me and make him think I'm cool. What do I look like? A miracle worker? A mic. I mean it. Don't you have any shame? If you're gonna be Jessica being Enid. Did you really expect for me to care about what you were saying? Yes, actually. And you're gonna be Liz. Then who am I gonna be? You're you. In a crowded hall, you see there's a beauty standing. Is she really everywhere? A reflection, one always calls out to you. The other shy and quiet. Could there be two different girls who look the same at sweet valley? Konnichiwa. Bless you. I didn't sneeze. It's a Japanese greeting. I think it's so great that your family's taken an exchange student. Yeah. I mean, he's never been to America before. I just want him to be completely comfortable. But don't expect him to be as cool as me. <laughs> we'll give him two minutes if he's a slow learner. When's he arriving? Not for a whole... Ten minutes? Later. Did you get a load of Amy Sutton's makeup? Oh, it was oh, pity. That's so wrong with that outfit. It totally did not go. No, not at all. Hot sauce. Does that mean goodbye? Sauce. Winston, you're gonna be late. Hot sauce. Hot sauce. So you've tried Patman's pepper shake. Did I mention I put it in the water too? <laughs> Thanks for my new boxer shorts. Yeah, I'm wearing them right now. Uh-huh. See you tonight. I love you. You're here to help troubled teens, not chat with your girlfriend. That was my mom. Look, no personal calls. I'm sorry, Mike, go on. I can't help thinking that my parents would have had more time for each other if they hadn't have invested so much time in my football games. I felt exactly the same way after my parents split. Did you play football too? No. Eventually I realized it had nothing to do with me and I stopped feeling guilty. How long did it take? I'm giving it another year. You're kidding, right? <laughs> yeah, but it wasn't easy. We have a referral number here if you'd like to speak with a professional counselor. Ah, uh, I don't know. I'd like to speak with you. You've been through it. Please deposit 25 sure. cents for the next Uh-oh, my quarter's running out. You're at a payphone? I was changing into my Superman costume and thought I'd check in. Hey, what's this glowing green rock? <laughs> Stop that, you'll get me into trouble. Sorry. Of course, that wouldn't be a problem if we were talking in person. Are you asking me out? I don't know. Would you say yes? I guess you won't know until you try. Announcing the arrival of flight 337 at 884. The passengers from Tokyo. Did I miss them? Mm -hmm. Damn! Uh, poor guy's probably lost. He's no way of communicating. At the mercy of the cruel USA without me to protect him. Koichi Yamasaki. Um, Ikura desu ka? <laughs> you must be Winston Egbert. What you again? I made us dinner reservations at La Maison. See you tonight, Koichi. I'm looking forward to it. We have dates tonight. I hope you don't mind. <laughs> good morning. Well, good morning to you, too. Did you have happy flakes for breakfast? I have a date tonight. With whom? I can't tell you. You wouldn't know him. If I don't know him, he can't be anybody important. <laughs> so who is it? 
this guy who I've been helping over the team hotline. But that's all I can say without betraying his confidence. His name's Mike, but that's all I can say. You can say why you like him. Nope. If I tell you anymore, I'd have to kill you. <laughs> Your dad makes rubber food. For windowless place. Most restaurants in Japan have them. Cool. Here. Check this out. Oh. That is the most realistic rubber filet mignon I've ever seen. <laughs> I can't wait to meet him. We've never met? Well, just on the phone. We reached out and touched each other. I hope he's that good in person. Liz, Enid, meet Koichi. Koichi, Enid, Elizabeth. Hi. Hi, it's a pleasure to meet you. Hi. Both of you. Your English is perfect. Well, thanks. I've had an American tutor since I was three. And of course, I watch American movies on cable. <laughs> That's really impressive. We'll see you guys around. Bye. It was a pleasure meeting both of you. Bye. Jessica. Say hi to Koichi. Hi, Koichi. There's two of them? They're twins. Welcome to America. <laughs> Man, unbelievable. I've only heard rumors of someone scoring four million on CyberGoat. I'm a little off today, you know, jet lag. My baby sister can score four and a half on that game. How do you do that? I wouldn't eat those if I were her. <laughs> Lila, meet Koichi Yamasai. He flew in from Tokyo yesterday. Hi. Ooh, mohair. Finally, someone who appreciates haute couture. We'll have to take a little shopping expedition together. Sounds wonderful. Ooh, what an adventure. Standing around a dressing room saying, you don't look fat like <laughs> <laughs> Believe me, I've been there. <clears throat> well, then, maybe you should show him around. That sounds great. Yeah, I'll catch you later. Thanks a lot. Mm-hmm. What's up? Hey, remember that uh, swing we were talking mm -hmm. about earlier? Right. Hold on like this. Okay. You think low to high, <laughs> you'll be uh, sure. Of the millions of foreign exchange students, yeah. I get the Japanese Bruce. Yeah, dude, you and I are going to get along great. Man. Yes, definitely. <laughs> <clears throat> Don't let Bruce fool you. The guy put hot sauce in my shake. <laughs> Winston. Things aren't always what they seem. In Japan, when you dislike somebody, you smile, nod, and say yes to everything they say. Really? Yes. Oh, because I was... <laughs> hey, wait a minute. Enid? Just said you were down here. I thought I'd join you and Tad at a movie, if that's OK. What about your date with Mike? He's probably not my type. So, what should we see? Deadly attraction or fatal desire? OK. Mike's the star quarterback at Bridgewater. So? So? He dates cheerleaders and stuff. What if I'm not pretty enough for him? Aided, what are you talking about? You're pretty. You're interesting. This guy is lucky to be going out with you. You're right. He's very lucky. He's never been so lucky. What if this guy's a total porker? He probably looks like Porky Pig. Hey, Porky's cute. Enid, stop panicking. I'm sure he's a really nice, regular guy. Yeah. With the regular guy, I've got to date with the regular guy. Okay. Okay. Oh, hey. Can I help you? I, uh, I need, um, a napkin. What's wrong with you? I just made myself look like a total complete spaz in front of Mike. He's probably laughing at me right now. Oh, yeah, your big date. So how many heads does he have? You gotta help me, Jess. Go in there and tell him I'm having an asthma attack. I don't think that'll improve things. OK, OK. Well, come in with me and make him think I'm cool. What do I look like? A miracle worker? I don't know. 
he sees me with you, he'll think I'm popular. Well, that does make sense. All right, but this is my one good deed for the year. Okay, which one of you is Mike? It's me. I'm Mike. Mm. Hi. Hey. I mean it. You are? Well, <laughs> you look fantastic. Thanks. Ready to go? I thought we could stay here and talk. Here's so boring. Let me show you where the real action is. You are not at all what I expected. She knew how much he meant to me. I'm so sorry, Enid. I don't know what's wrong with her. Mike Montreal? This is such a coup. You know I only collect the best. How could you? It was simple. You wanted him to think you were cool. Now he does. Only because he thinks I'm you. Details. Don't you have any shame? It wouldn't have worked out between them anyway. He's way out of her league. I'll tell him the truth. How would Mike feel if he found out you put me up to this? It would shake his whole belief in the teen hotline. You think he won't care that you've stabbed Enid in the back? Not when I tell him the only reason Enid wanted to go out with him was so she could be in the popular crowd. And when he sees you, he'll know it's true. Come on, Lila. <laughs> Enid, you have to call him first and tell him the truth. I can't. I mean, if I tell him I was too chicken to talk to him, he'll think I'm a total loser. Besides, Jess is right. He is going through a lot. You can't just let Jess have him. Believe me, I have no intention of letting that happen. Hello. Hey, it's me. You okay? Uh-huh. You know, a lot of times, first dates can be a little weird. Yeah, I guess. But I've been thinking all day about you, me, a kiss. So have I. So I made reservations for a balloon ride. Mike, I don't want to disappoint you, but there's something I have to tell you. What? I... I'm afraid of heights. We can't go ballooning. She said you always wanted to go up in a hot air balloon. I did? Yeah, well, I guess I wasn't myself last night. Look, I know we didn't have much to talk about. I guess I was just a little nervous. I know we can do better. Okay, let's go play miniature golf. Miniature golf? Sure. Hi, I'm Wendy. Hi there. How you doing? Good. I'm Koichi. Yeah, you're the exchange student. Looks like Koichi's fitting in pretty well. Yeah, no, we already have some more friends than I do. And he's better than me at everything. I don't think he's trying to compete with you. I know he's not. That's what makes it so irritating. Whoa! Aiden! Liz, Todd, quick, hop in. What's wrong? It's an emergency. We have to go play miniature golf. Just get in! Okay. But I get the red ball. This is ridiculous. I'm not going to pretend to be Jessica. But you have to. Now, wait a minute. If you're going to be Jessica being Enid, and you're going to be Liz, well, then who am I going to be? You're you. I'm not going to get the red ball, am I? I still think you should tell him the truth. Eat it. Hey. Mike, this is my best friend, Elizabeth. Liz Wakefield, pleased to meet you. You too. This is my um, boyfriend, Todd. Hi, Todd. Mike. Hey, mind if we join you? Sure, we love it. Guy. Easy, Todd. She's supposed to be me. Then you should kill him. So, I tried talking to my parents. Look, a castle. You know, I was born to live in a castle. <laughs> Hello? Can we get some service around here? <sighs> 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 
ladies first. Sometimes there are some times when you don't know what to think and you don't know what to say and you don't know what to do. But tell me, did you even notice? I didn't even have a shadow and we were standing in the sunshine. Next to you is feeling love for you, is feeling love that's true. But you didn't even notice, I didn't even have a shadow. And we were standing in the sunshine, oh yeah. I'm not myself today, I'm not myself today. And if you ask me to stand up and just be me, well, I'd fall down. Hey, a gift. From Winston. What is it? It looks like an octopus tentacle. So, like, where's the rest of it? Oh, God! <laughs> Thank you. Can you move? You're blocking my light. Enid, what is with you today? You're acting so different. I don't know what you're talking about. Can we go home now? This astroturf is giving me a rash. That is what I'm talking about. I mean, where's the warmth I heard over the phone? You want me to be like how I was on the hotline? That's just acting. Did you really expect for me to care about what you were saying? Yes, actually, I did. <laughs> You're getting a zip. Man. I think he could use you about now. Wish me luck. Finally. It's working. I think he's really starting to hate me. Good. What's the matter? Your friend Enid. On the phone, she's great. Talk, we laugh. But in person, well, she's kind of obnoxious. That's too bad. Maybe she's just nervous when she's around you. Maybe I'm expecting too much. I better find her. I don't want her to think I'm ignoring her, OK? Give her time? What am I, an idiot? Hey, what's going on? I don't believe this. Enid? Mike! Todd! Enid? Enid? Mm-hmm. So, I asked Liz to pretend to be Jessica, so you'd get a taste of what Jess was really like. But I had no idea it would turn out like this. You went to all this trouble to be with me? Mike, listen. I'm sorry. I should have just told you the truth in the first place. But I was so afraid you wouldn't like me. Why? You're the only person I can tell my problems to. I know. And I hope this hasn't changed that. I really want to be there for you. I want that too. So, you're not disappointed I don't look like Jessica? You look perfect to me. Get out! She likes to pretend that she's not in love with me. I'm not in love with you. See? Check this out. Watch, watch, watch this. Hi, Jess. <laughs> Finally. <laughs> it's about time. <laughs> There's Mike. Now get out. What? Wait a minute! Have a nice trip, Jess. Enid! Sayonara! Yes, don't worry. 
still have us for company. Hey, Koichi, how long did he say this flight was? About four hours. Crowded.